Good morning everyone, welcome to another vlog. I'm so excited for this week. I just have a good feeling that it's just gonna be a great week. So happy Monday. I have so many things I need to do. I literally woke up this morning and I had a dream that I was calling my insurance because I need to call them. I need to call so bad. I've been putting it off. I'm literally gonna sit here and I'm gonna write my to-do list because I have so much I feel like I need to do, even just like around the house. Like I need to do the laundry. It looks like a mess. Like I just, I don't even know if I should show. Like I just am so humbled because it's so messy. Anyway, so I'm gonna sit here and just write my to-do list and just get it all out of my head because whenever I have so much I need to do, I just get overwhelmed and I end up not doing anything because I can't decide what to start with. Okay, I've been working on stuff for my con for the past like 30 minutes and I realized I haven't eaten anything today and it's noon. So I'm gonna make some food because I'm getting hungry. You and your bathroom, why do you Hey friends. Fight. You know, if I'm gonna be doing homework, I'm gonna be doing homework. Why am I an old man? Five ever. Okay, so I may have been on the couch for a lot longer than I planned. Uh, it's 4.30. But, I was, oh my gosh. I have not called insurance yet. I was so proud of myself. I was like, oh, I got so much done. Like, I got all this stuff. I didn't even do the tasks that I've been trying to do all day. And they, like, it closes in, in 30 minutes. I... Thank you for calling the Utah Department. I just had a quick question. Okay, I finally finished and I called everyone that I wanted to call. I really need to get out my pajamas. It's kind of embarrassing. All right, we're going to take my 20-week bump photo. So here's some behind the scenes. We're just using a plain wall in our apartment. Nothing fancy. Oh, the fan fell. I'm glad y'all can't see the floor. It's so bad. <laughs> and here's my handsome cameraman. Look at him. He's a professional, you know. I only hire the best of the best. And then do your best to focus it on my face. But why are you leaning? Like, just stand normal. Let me just do a couple more looking straight for him. It, it's me. It's me. It's not you. It's me. <laughs> hey, it looks like I kind of have a bum. And now we just need the Polaroid real quick, Luke. Hey, hold on. Hold fun. on. Let me relax. We'll see how it looks. Thank you. Thank you for your service. And he leaves me hanging. I finished this homework. Thank you. I'm headed to pick up my friend to go up the canyon. She got a camera recently, so she wants me to help teach her how to use it. So we're just gonna go up and take cute pictures, like my favorite thing to do. Such a violent spring. Look how cute. You guys, it is beautiful out here. Even though I was here four days ago and I swear half the leaves are gone. Like this was all red. It's crazy. And you said you came here what? Last, well not to this spot, but you drove up to the canyon and it already looks different. Last Saturday. Last Saturday. It goes so fast, it's crazy. The photographer's in the wild. So pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. It's so pretty. Oh, it's amazing. Look at that. Good morning everyone. Sorry if you can hear my car, but I'm running late because now I need to go to my workout class. It's gonna be a great day. This is my first week that I'm gonna try and go to both Tuesday and Thursday. And apparently Tuesday is more focused on arms and so I already know that I'm gonna die. <laughs> That was probably my favorite workout class so far. I know this is only my fourth time going, but that was so good. I just am feeling a lot more confident. So, really good workout. Now I'm gonna go get our laundry, and then I'm gonna go eat lunch. I have two meetings today for my business, one with my mentor, and then one with my friends who are the engineers that are helping me design the bed. I should probably do some work for that as well. Anyway, so let's go get our laundry. 
It's been a couple hours since I last updated you, but I finished my meetings for the day and it was so good to see my friends. I have these two guy friends that are studying engineering that are helping me build the product for my business. I feel like I need to make a whole separate video just talking about my business because it's like a whole separate life, I feel like. Anyways, now I'm gonna go get a car wash and go to Costco and Walmart to do some grocery shopping. I have a couple returns I also need to make. And so I'm just gonna try and do it quick because it's dinner time and I'm getting really hungry. I'm also hoping that Costco has some samples because that can be a little snack to tide me over. Um, why am I out of breath? You guys, something crazy happened when I was in Walmart. I was like standing there looking for all the, like my produce and stuff and I was like, man, like my stomach is kind of cramping. And then I was like, wait, am I hungry? Like, what is that feeling? In my mind, it took me like a couple seconds. I was like, oh, that's kind of weird. And then I was like, wait, I think that's fluttering. Like, you, it's like, isn't that what they call it before you feel a kicks? It's like the feeling of like the fl flutters. I'm pretty sure that's what it was because it literally felt like something was like turning or like kicking and stuff or fluttering. I feel like that's just the, a good way to describe it. And I, I called Luke immediately. I was like, wait, I think I just felt the baby for the first time. And it was just so funny. I was like, oh, am I cramping or something? Like I didn't know what the feeling was. And I was like, no, that was definitely the baby moving. So I just had to tell you because I thought that was crazy. It was my first time like really feeling movement down there I feel like so it was really weird. Is there sauce that comes with the fry? Would you like a receipt? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. You too. I just got home but I need help bringing in the groceries and Luke's finishing a quiz so while I wait for him I'm gonna start eating because I'm still hungry. That is what I've been craving. Look who joined me everyone. This is what happens when she does the cooking. <laughs> this week I'm in charge of cooking and this is... <laughs> hey it tastes good don't it? What do you think about me feeling flutters for the first time at Walmart? I don't believe you do. I feel them. I don't know. Can you feel flutters? Yeah, probably. I don't know. It was weird. It felt like there was something in there. I wonder why. <laughs> Happy Wednesday, everyone. I apologize if my mouth looks weird or if I talk funny because this side of my face is numb. I went to the dentist this morning. I started recording because I need to get up and clean out the fridge and the office. That's my goal today. And so I was like, let me record so I actually get off the couch. So I wanna show you the before and after. I'm, don't judge, okay? This is very humbling to show. I don't even know how our fridge got this dirty. I swear I cleaned it a month ago. <laughs> Literally the garlic hanging on for dear life. I'll show you the office, but you can't judge. Sadly, the office becomes our just dropping area. If there's something we don't wanna deal with, we just throw it in here. And yeah, it's terrible. Anyway, I'm gonna get changed and then start cleaning and I will update you after. Okay, so it's a lot later and I am so tired. Tonight has been so busy. I started dinner, wasn't able to finish it. Shout out to Luke for finishing it, thanks. Because I didn't start it early enough before my meeting. I had a church meeting tonight. It was two hours. It was so long. It was good. We got a lot of good stuff done, but it was so long. Before I go to bed though, I wanted to show you the progress that I made because I'm so proud of myself. I worked on the office all afternoon and I did more than I thought I was gonna do, but it did take longer than I thought. So I didn't do the fridge yet, but that's okay because I am really happy with how it all turned out. I'm starting like a little baby corner. I'll just show you, I'll show you. All right, so here's the after. You can see the floor. Oh my gosh, wow, how amazing. And then this is what I decided to work on. I wasn't really planning to do it quite yet, but I figured right, why not, I was in the mood. So I made it this little baby corner. I figured this would be a great spot because we weren't using this shelf in our bedroom, so I just moved it over here. We had a couple of people order some things off of our registry already, and so I'm so grateful. And I know when those come in that I can just put those right in the cubbies. Anyway, so I'm really excited. Now we have a place to put the baby things. I organized our drawers everything was just super messy and cluttered so then i put things away up top as well and just kind of rearranged some things it took me a couple hours but i'm so happy with how it turned out and now luke doesn't have to work in a tornado of a room <laughs> i am gonna put dinner away and then go to bed because we're so tired oh here comes luke say good night i'm so tired i know this dude's been studying like all day for the past three days straight. And he took his test not today. Even, I took one test today. I have another tomorrow. I'll have yeah. another interview tomorrow. Oh yeah, your MCG interview's yeah. tomorrow. 
He's trying to escape my hug. That's so exciting. We have to wake up early and give him a haircut before his interview. I'm seriously so excited. All right, well apparently this battery is dead as well. I was gonna say good morning. I apologize because last night the battery died and I just switched the batteries and this one's dead too. I woke up earlier today because I needed to give Luke a haircut before his interview, which he's in right now. And I feel like a proud mom, like I'm so happy for him. And I'm trying to be quiet because I don't know if he can hear me. His interview is actually a couple hours long because they have like a whole scheduled day. They said that they're gonna like welcome them, do an overview of like the school and the program. Then they split into groups and like one group gets a tour of campus and then they switch and they get the actual interview where it's a group interview. So I don't really know how it works. I'm gonna hurry because I'm going to my workout class with a friend and I'm meeting her outside in one minute. So I've been sitting here again working on baby stuff. It's just my favorite. I just love it so much. My mom is throwing me a baby shower, AKA I'm planning everything that I want it to be. <laughs> She's working full time and super busy and I have time and I love planning and organizing parties like this. So I was like, don't even worry. Like I will put something together because I had no idea what I wanted, so how would she know what I want? So I was just looking on Pinterest. Then I had to do some stuff for my church calling because we have an event tonight and I just finished that. Now I'm gonna go clean the kitchen because I have like an hour until I need to get ready for the event. So I gotta go quick. It is not smelling great because of cooking dinner last night and I didn't clean that up. So I really wanna clean it because the smell is not, not good. I just finished the fridge and I'm so proud. It looks beautiful. So if you don't remember, here's the before. I don't even know how our fridge got this dirty. Okay, now here's the after. It's so satisfying to clean because it just looks amazing whenever it's done. Look how pretty and organized it is. Now I just need to do that whole situation. Okay, I started the dishwasher. You probably can hear that. And I got ready for my meeting. Let's do a quick outfit of the night. Cute. Okay, I need to hurry because I'm running late. Is anyone surprised? Is anyone surprised I'm running late? I am. Oh, whatever. <laughs> We're setting up before the event, and so I gotta get going. But I'll see y'all after. We're gonna go get milkshakes after. Ooh, should I invite someone fun. or just us? Just us? Yeah, maybe I? Yeah, just us. We don't need nobody. Good news, everyone. The event went great. Everyone is so nice. It's just so fun getting together. And now I'm with the one and only, <laughs> the myth, the legend. Wait, what's the? Man, the man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> Should we? Oh, pumpkin bits got <laughs> Yeah, that looks really good. I like to embarrass him when we're in public. Okay. This is so cute. We're having an impromptu date night. Isn't that what it's called? An impromptu. Impromptu. Impromptu date night. Wow, he's really enjoying it. I've ate like nothing the last two days to be honest. <laughs> I know. It was so funny because he's like, do you want to go on a drive? Do you want to go outside? I'm like, you can tell he's only been staring at a computer for the last five days. All right, we're going to go up the candy and try and see the northern lights. So, wish us luck. He's on a mission to see the northern lights. I have no idea where Luke went, but I'm feeling comfy. So, I think I might just hang out. Okay, tell us the report. What's the view? No luck, but... I think it might be coming back tomorrow. Really? I think so. Dang. Thanks for the fun date night. That milkshake was bomb. It, it was, was good. so good. Can't wait. We just got home and there was a package at our door. I'm pretty sure it's from our baby registry, but now I'm confused. Yes, it is. That's so nice of them. Oh my gosh, that makes me so happy. I gotta put it in our baby area since I made the baby corner in our office. I'm thinking one of these could be like a medicine one. And then the like travel sound machine, I'm just gonna put by itself on like one of these shelves. Oh, that is so nice. Alrighty, well now we're gonna go to bed. I need to wash my face and stuff, but I wanted to record that because it's our first thing for our registry, which is so fun. I just come and he's in the office just Oh, I'll come join you. Good morning, everyone. I'm really excited for today because we have our 20 week anatomy scan. <laughs> you can't see it, but Luke is off camera, just so aesthetic. You're probably wondering why Luke is sitting in a swimsuit in my glider. <laughs> no reason, 
I'm just kidding. I just like wearing my swimsuit. <laughs> We're gonna go to the gym this morning. Luke's gonna go on a swim. But Luke doesn't have class today, so we're just hanging out. And he got all of his homework and projects and tests well, and I'm everything. <laughs> he got all of it done that was due this week. So he's taking a, a day to relax a little because it's been nonstop. After we go to the pool, we're gonna come back and change and eat lunch. And then go to our doctor's appointment. I'm so excited because it's like a long appointment today. It's anatomy scan, so they're doing like checking all the body parts and stuff. We can get like pictures of his little hands or face or I don't know. But it's gonna be a good day. I'm excited to update you guys at the doctor and uh, see the little baby. See the babe. So cute. Yeah, so we'll let you know how the day goes. Okay, we're about to leave, but I had to show you. I made this for breakfast, and it looks amazing. I saw an Instagram reel yesterday where she made avocado toast with tomatoes and balsamic vinegar, and I'm so excited to try. What's your reaction? Mmm, you know what it tastes like? Avocado toast with tomatoes and balsamic vinegar. That's exactly what it tastes like. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> Because I like to embarrass you, Luke. That's why. <laughs> We're on our way to our 20 week anatomy scan. Tell the people, how are you feeling? Hi, people. My hair. I, I got out of the shower. My hair. I'm sorry. I'm feeling good. <laughs> why is it so close to your face? Uh, yeah, this is a normal way to hold. Oh, look. It's sort of look normal there. Exactly. <laughs> what if they tell us it's actually not a boy? Then I will know that. Actually, you can't say that. <laughs> I'll know that his SRY a gene is messed person, up. A normal person, a normal person would have just said, "Then the blood test was wrong. That's crazy." But no, no you say <laughs> the SRY gene would be not showing. Oh boy. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. People are not gonna understand what you're saying. So, little science lesson here. <laughs> the uh, default pathway is for humans to look like girls. The males on the Y gene have something called SRY gene, which activates a lot of the things that differentiate men and women. Um, XY people with XY chromosomes have testes. People with XX have ovaries. However, it, without SRY gene, if SRY gene is not functioning on the Y chromosome, the body won't let they won't tell the testes to descend into the scrotum. Um, it will look like our child is a girl, even if they have XY chromosomes and is a boy. Um, genetically. So, so Luke, so. how are you feeling? Are you excited to see our baby on the ultrasound? Yeah, I'm pretty excited. <laughs> I usually only You're start. more excited than us. You've been checking the pregnancy app way more than I have. It's so cute. I usually only start spouting off random fun facts if I'm excited. So. There you go. Or I'm incredibly bored, one of the two. Oh, wow. That was a lot quicker than I thought. She was like speeding through. We just finished our appointment and baby is healthy. Yay. And he's happy, he told me. But everything looks good. He's average on pretty much everything. Except for Our son the is thing just that average. Matters. Except for what matters. <laughs> yeah, he was proud to show that he was a boy. Let's just say that. It's a fun spot. <laughs> but look, oh my gosh. He's so cute. His little feet. Oh, so cute. The crazy part that I thought was so cool was seeing his heart. Like being able to see his heart move like that was crazy. And she, you could see the four chambers of the heart and we got a video of like the heartbeat and it sounds different from every chamber. Like it was so cool, like seeing it move like that. And he was, he was actually moving I feel like a good bit. He was yeah, kind of squirming was, around. Dancing. So it, that, that part was probably my favorite, like seeing the heart, like, you know? What was your favorite part? Hmm. Gotta be the skeleton. The creepy skeleton. Spooky. Yeah, for real. It smells so good in here. Oh my gosh. Look at this. That chicken looks amazing, dude. Look how fancy this is. This is what happens when you marry a chef. I'm gonna try this. You were waiting. <laughs> you were waiting to do that. That is so good. That chicken turned out really good. Seriously, I might give it like a 10 out of 10. Really? No. Yeah. All the flavor and everything is so good. I cleaned up everything after dinner and I started another load in the dishwasher and it looks so much better. It makes me so happy going to bed with a clean space. I also got the video uploaded on YouTube and it is so cute. I already know it's gonna be one of my favorites to watch back. It's just such a fun memory. Now I'm gonna get ready for bed. I think we're gonna watch a show. 
I might do a little bit more editing tonight, but we shall see. This weekend's gonna be pretty chill, so I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here, but I really appreciate you watching, and I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!